Hey pretty girls, it's Tay and we have an unboxing and demonstration guys. So this company reached out to me called Polono and they was like, if we send you a thermal printer, would you review it? Of course I said yes. So we're going to get right into the unboxing y'all. So first things first, actually I think it's pronounced Polono. That's what we're going to go with. And y'all can let me know in the comments what y'all think it's pronounced. P-O-L-O-N-O. -O -O. And they are a thermal printing company. And so first we're going to open up the labels that they sent me. And they sent me 2.25 by 1.25 thermal labels. And if y'all know me, then y'all already know. Those are labels I used to use when I was um, having my sticker business. And those are the size labels that I use. Like when I print out my little discount codes and stuff like that for my customers' boxes. So today we're going to literally use these to print out discount codes for my Black Friday customers. So everybody who shop on Black Friday is going to get a special little goodie. And um, I'm not really sure what the goodie is going to be just yet, but we're going to figure it out by the end of this video. And I'm going to literally print it out on this little slip and I will drop one of these slips in almost every package. So I probably will probably print out, I think this comes with... 1,000 so obviously I'm not going to print out 1,000 I might probably print out 250 and if y'all are returning subscribers and returning customers y'all know last year on Black Friday I did this thing called the pink ticket so we'll be having pink tickets again so these will be the pink tickets um I'm going to probably print out let's just say 250 pink tickets and we're going to get started so the first things first um I will leave the, the Amazon link down below and we're gonna get the printer out of the box. And right off the bat, I definitely will say this printer is pretty, I won't say the word heavy in terms of too much, but I can tell that this is a quality, quality printer. And the first thing I notice is the name, and it just says the logistics label printer. And then on the back, it just has its specifications. It's a direct thermal printer. It print 150 mm per second. I got the color pink and it's a USB connection. So we're going to be plugging this up into my, um, should I use my iMac or my laptop? I'm not for sure what I want to decide, but I do. If you have an iMac, then you have to buy an adapter for like the USB. And I already have the adapter for my adapter for my other thermal printer. So now we're going to open up the box and... I am going to show y'all what it looks like. As y'all can see, I can hold this in one hand and open it up. So it's pretty good, sturdy, but it's also compact, meaning it won't take up too much of your space. Oh my gosh, y'all. This is so pretty. Yeah, so, so pretty. So I want to take off the foam. And this is what the printer is looking like. We're going to get it a 360. This is the top of the printer. This is the face. The face has pink on the outer and then black right here. This is what a paper feeds through. And then on the back, it has its connection. So you have your on and off. You have your power adapter. Then you have the plug that you will put into the computer. And then um, they also provide you, of course, with all of the cords you need to connect. So we're going to look at those now. And boom. So we're going to connect this to my laptop. So that way we can get printing immediately, okay? Because I'm going to need a lot of pink tickets. And I'm going to need a lot of um, logo logo stickers because y'all know me i've been in the phase of i can just do it myself so y'all gonna watch me print out some logo stickers and these are gonna go on all of my boxes on the inside of my boxes and on my bubble mailers as well so yeah i'm super super excited and these are the two cords again this is the usb this is a usb c so you have to plug this part it's gonna get plug this part up into the computer this part goes in the back of the actual printer and then this is the power adapter where you plug this part up into your power source and then this part up into the actual thermal printer so we're going to do that now so we're going to plug up the power source and then we're going to plug up the power adapter the usb 
and boom so the next thing y'all gonna see me hooking it up to my computer okay so I am back um I just put the printer over here to the side and then I have it plugged up to my computer using the USB and I will say that you have to open it up let me see can I do this with one hand hold on guys let me see how to, oh I gotta use two hands so in order to open it up you have to use two hands don't forget that guys do is just bring these two pieces to the front and then it lifts up just like that and because they sent me they sent me small labels the 2.25 by the 1.25 I have to manually switch the size by squeezing in the blue pieces so you squeeze in the blue pieces to fit and because I've had a thermal printer before I kind of know you know how to operate this so you feed it in through the back and you kind of can see so I have to like squeeze it a little bit more you want to kind of give it enough room for it to flow but not too much room that it actually bends so as y'all can see the paper is now in there and all you do is just close it up just like that and after that, okay, boom, there it goes. So now that it's fed in there, you have your row of thermal labels behind you. Now we're going to do some test printing. And if y'all y'all already know, my business literally was centered around the 2.25 labels. So I want to just go into my files and find the 2.25 label to print. And we're going to get started. And I feel like this setup was super, super easy. Um, Let me go and the print because it didn't give us a driver or anything like that so i'm assuming that it might be automatically connected so if i just press add printer let's see if it pops up um let's see give me one second guys Okay, y'all. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. They did include the instructions. Obviously, I, I I opened the package up so quick that I forgot to even I forgot I even had instructions. So they included instructions. So all you have to do now is just install the driver to the computer, and then you'll be good to go. I'm about to show y'all that part next. Okay, y'all. I found the little driver. Remember, I just told y'all about the driver. So all you have to do literally is just connect this little driver to your computer. You can either put it in your iMac or put it in your Windows computer. And after you connect the driver, it will come up on the screen. And then all you have to do is download. So it's coming up. And here go the driver files. And then all I have to do now is click that one and go to the Windows. And you see how it says, hold on, let me zoom in for you all. Plono label printer drive. All you gotta do is just press yes and it will download to your computer. We're gonna ask you some instructions. And yeah. that I got it connected to the computer you see the Plono is right there and I'm gonna change the custom size because again like I said we're using 2.25 by 1.25 so I'm gonna just go down to the different menus and find the 2.25 by 1.25 which is that one right there and we're gonna change it to portrait and I said we're going to do what, 200? Let's just do 200 copies real quick. And it should print.
Okay, y'all, so that is the end of this video. It was super, super easy to set this up. All you have to do is connect connect the printer to the computer, connect the driver, download the driver material onto your computer. You can use your iMac or your um, Windows, and all you do is just literally press print and choose the printer. Um, thank you so much, Polono, for giving me this printer sponsor in today's video. It is super, super, super easy. Once you have the stickers up there, it is super, super easy. You can use this to print out shipping labels. You can use this to print out stickers, thank yous, things like that. I'll be using this to print out like kind of logo stickers with my business name, my website, and discount code for next time. So um, if you like videos like this, let me know in the comments down below what you want to see next. And thank you so much, Polono, for sponsoring today's video. Bye.